Yeah, look at that. Whoa! Holy shit! I've gone too far. Oh no, I missed it. Oh, fuck it. Leave it. Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Mike and this is Infamous First Light. So in the last part, the first part, we pretty much seen how Fetch was, um, how she started with her powers and what happened to her brother, Brett, and we got a little bit of a glimpse into the facility where she was being held, where she first met Augustine, and we got to do a little bit of a training course where Augustine was teaching Fetch how to fight, pretty much using her powers. And now we've just finished that training course and we're right here. So we're on this little challenges menu. So the left panel shows the Curtain K battle arenas available for you at any time. So they're little challenges kind of. Kind of like Batman it looks like. Arkham on. Asylum. Take a seat. I'd like you to resume your explanation of what happened in Seattle. So we're going back two years once again. After a night of tearing up the city looking for my brother, I ended up back at what was left of our boat. That's where I met him. He was looking for Brent too. Who's this guy? Excuse me, sweetheart. I'm sorry, have you seen a fella rocking a mohawk around here somewhere? Wait, do you know... Do you know Brent? Are you with those Russians? What, what the occurrence? No, hell no. Well, are, are you saying they're the ones who did this? Damn it, they keep kidnapping my employees. Kidnap? Wait! Do you know where they have him? Can you take me? <laughs> Slow down there, sugar. No, I'm sure you do not want to get that pretty face caught up in all this trouble. You know, I don't know what you had worked out with Brent, but... Uh... He's my brother. Help me. Brother? Uh, are you Fetch? I'm Shane. Shane? You know, Brent never told me that his sister was such a pretty little thing. Please! Just tell me where to look. Uh, east side, mainly. Thank you. And if you think of anything else, then call me on Brent's phone, all right? Yeah, yeah, sure. Whatever you say, sweetheart. Just make sure you take care of that, all right? Oh my god, who's this guy? This guy's so creepy. And he seems a bit phony. He's like... The way he approached her was like... It's like he was thinking of a plan before he spoke to her. So we're gonna go to the top of a neon sign. That's gonna give us a better view, maybe, of where we're heading to find Brent. Fetch, now I'll put out my feelers, but these occurrence are on a hair trigger. We'll have to move fast on a leaf. Okay. I'm already headed to some neon gas. Oh, 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 I reckon. Now, I love huffing gas as much as the next guy, but that really... It's a trick I picked up back in Jersey. The gas helps me run insanely fast. All right. I don't know how to take your word on that car. What other secrets you got going on under that hood? Yeah, that's big enough. So gas makes her run insanely fast. What if she farts or something and then just, like, pushes her forward? Drain neon signs to release neon energy. Whoa! Oh. Salmon Lake. All right, you lazy neon gas. Go make yourself useful. So these are like speed boosts, I think. I read about this in one of the re reviews. So collect neon lumens to earn skill points. These things. <laughs> Woo! That's a boost, okay. So if I run like this. I need all the firepower I can get. Okay, so they're not actually coming in use just yet, I don't think. A big one. And it moves. Kinda like dread uh, blast shards that when you play as Delson. Did you have something to do with that light show by the needle? I told you I needed some neon gas. Just Focus on Brent. Uh, uh, I gotta go. Something really distracting just came into my field of view. You wanna stand? Bye. This girl knows the chemistry, talking about neon gas and all that. So we're gonna gas. We're gonna dash through um, these neon clouds to catch the lumen. Zipping through those clouds, I'll haul ass. Let's haul some ass. Let's do this. You luscious neon fatty. I'm meeting you whole. I'm meeting you whole. This girl's hungry. Whoa. 
So much fast. Oh, shit. <laughs> I missed this. So I'm chasing this blue ball. Come here, bastard. Yeah. Now where do I go? Am I done? They taste better when they run. <laughs> Collectibles and other side content can be viewed from the world map. So we can press... There we go. Progress in the district to show... Excuse me, I read that all wrong. Progress in the district is shown in the legend to the right. So we've got 10 lumens to collect still, four race, three more races and one neon graffiti. I think those total numbers will increase the more we actually unlock the city. So we've got a bunch of races around here. Those lumen races are pretty much catch the um, the blue ball before it gets away, I guess. Okay, so the occurrence are coming to me. So... Where's Brent? Take out the occurrence. Oh, no, Take him out for what? For lunch? Whoa, grenade, what's that? Defeating enemies builds up energy for a special attack. So let's destroy these guys, and then we can build up our energy. This guy's got... Where's this guy's weak point? His shin! Give me your shin! Uh, there's one more guy. Where's he gone? There he is. I've got singularity available. So it's going to be showing me now how I use this, probably. Ass hats. Yeah. You guys got hats for ass. So let's try this. Once you've defeated enough enemies, you can trigger a neon singularity. Boom! What's it done? Whoa, it's like a... What do you call that? It pulls stuff in. Wormhole. Oh, hey! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> that was some, um, some crazy shit right there. Fetch, darling. Uh, my feelers just pawed something juicy. Dude. Now, the occurrence are about to receive a stockpile of guns. You help me steal them, and I'll have 50 armed men out kicking indoors looking for Brent within the hour. Great, thank you. And enough with the feelers. I get it, you're a creep, okay? Let's move past it. Uh, now, now, I will have you know that some women find me irresistible. Sure, if you're paying them. It Look, just meet me in the alley behind that sandwich shop when you're ready to steal the guns, alright? Au revoir. Um, so even though Fetch was kind of saying, maybe two days ago or something like that, no, not use my powers, don't use my powers for anything. I've just killed about 20 men. Out of nowhere. Well, I want to see what this is here uh, before we actually carry on as well. Lumen. It's just Lumen you collect. So they're kind of probably in hard to reach places where you've got to climb a big building or jump between the gap. So these can be used to upgrade our abilities. So we're going to pick these up, of course, whenever we see them. As we make our way to the next objective. And I'll, I'll either do some of the races in between a few missions here and there. Or I'll just do it in my own time when I'm not recording. So there's some lumen up there. Let's get this last piece here. And then we'll kind of stop playing around and make our way to the next objective. Oh, can fetch the graffiti as well, as well as the way Delson could. Where's this lumen? Oh, it's right up there. Okay. So we gotta make a run and jump on this. Let's get this shit. Is that a boost? Can we boost through that? Yeah, look at that! Whoa! Holy shit! I've gone too far. Oh no, I missed it! Oh, fuck it. Leave it. Too much messing around. We're gonna go and do the objective. We're gonna meet this guy, I think, behind something he said. Let's run across this. Whoa, shit. Oh, I was itching my nose. I just thought I could um, carry on without turning. <laughs> it seems I had to follow that. Hang on. So, we've got quite a bit of lumen right there. So, we can go to upgrades. Okay, so how much have we... We have eight. And it costs, like, three for that one, five for that one. So, let's see what this is. Increase neon capacity by 25%. That one. Hold R2 to fire a stream of neon bolts. So, it turns your neon bolt into a machine gun. Light speed. Press circle while in the air, we'll launch fetch forward. That's kind of cool. When in range, press triangle to dash towards an enemy and hit them with a massive attack, defeating an enemy with a normal melee combo, we will, will we charge the finisher attack. And laser focus slows time by an additional 50%. I kind of like the sound of that, dashing through the air. <laughs> but actually, because we're playing on a harder difficulty, maybe it'd be better to shoot faster. Ooh, it's a tough one. Let's go for the um, the faster bolts. Actually, no, you don't really need that because you're making precise shots anyway. Right, enough talking. Going for that. 
so we can dash through the air. Look at that! Whoa! <laughs> so she kind of like dashes forward in the air a bit before she goes downwards, before she loses her like momentum in the air. So there's a neon thing right here somewhere. There it is. Just get this quickly. Because we want to be able to make ourselves as, as badass as we can before we get it's too late, you know? Get as many upgrades as possible. Boom. So help Shane steal weapons from the occurrence. Fetch! My truck's loaded up! Let's go! Alright, buddy. I think I set off an alarm breaking in to get the guns. If the occurrence catch up with us, you better cover my ass. Let's go, it'll be fine. Now, you see, honey, if they find out it was me that stole this stuff, there'll be a retribution which I would very much like to avoid. Come on, you have a conduit on your side. They're hosed. We'll get these guns to your men, and they'll use them to find Brent's. We're good. They're stealing our guns! Hey! Stay close, I got We're borrowing your guns, mate. We're not stealing them. Get it right. I missed that guy. So, I think we're forced to be good as well. You know, in the main campaign, you have a choice between good karma and bad karma. I think Fetch is primarily trying to be good, because you can see when you kill people, you get like a blue symbol. Oh shit, there's loads. Um, hello. Rocket launcher up ahead. Come on, do something. Rocket launcher up ahead. Okay. Where? Where are you looking? This guy? Yeah, it's this guy. Shoot the explosives. Yeah, that'll do it. Oh my god. We're blocked. And now I'm ditching the truck. Come to me while I run. No. Shit. Destroy the car block. There's loads. Look how many enemies are. Shoot that guy. Come on. Some of these weak points are out the way, like out of sight. It's a bit of a pain. Shane's getting wrecked as well. So singularity time, I guess. That, I guess that's what you do to destroy the blockade. Is it? I don't think it is, is it? If it unless it does a massive explosion now, does it? No. That didn't work. So why do I destroy the cars? Okay, that'll do. Now that was too damn close. Smoke! I want smoke. Okay, Shane's Shane's driving away. Just for a bit. Give me a chance to recharge. Right. I know just the spot. This guy's a good driver, isn't he? Look at this guy taking shortcuts. Drain neon sign. What this one? Let's do this one here. Protect Shane. Shane, you got no health. I should have saved that. Uh, should the cops? Okay, we're shooting cops. This is this is the, what the life we live right now. This is the life we're living. We're shooting cops. We're cop killers. Who gave these guys a license? Oh god! Oh god! This is what people don't feel from the occurrence. I'm gonna try cutting through the park. Don't kill us! Don't kill us! Shane is wrecked. Oh no, we're getting shot still. Shane's dead. Bollocks. Protect Shane again. We've got half health this time and a better position. So, the game's quite forgiven right there, you can see. I can't get this guy. Give me a head. Nice. I think we're past the point where I just died. So we're okay for now. Alright, back on the road. We should be good. Or not. These guys aren't giving up. Any ideas? I've got an escape plan. Just have the time to ride. Dwayne, you ready with the bus? I see you. Coming your way. A bus? Who is that? My singularity is now available as well, so I can use that. If it gets too dangerous. Is that guy dead? Nope. He is now. Oh. Bus! <laughs> Okay, we need to um, get safety now, because... How come I never saw you on the news? Heavy hitter conduit like you must be public enemy number one. I got Brent. He keeps me grounded and low profile. Well, end of the line. Who are these guys? We'll unload here. Are these that... Oh, sorry. Oh, we made a hell of a team out oh, sorry. there in the streets. Imagine what we'd be like in the sack. 
Get your boys armed and out looking for Brents, or I'll lay a hole in your sack. So we've done something for him, now he's going to do something for us. That's the way this works. Whoa, whoa, now what if I told you I already have some guys asking around for your brother? I'll send you their position. They might have heard something by now. You go from creep to okay in just a sentence. How do you do that? Well, born and raised in Texas. Okay, so are we done? Let's leave these guys to just fight amongst themselves. So we are now heading towards... I can dash in here, look at that, way! I can make some decent distance here. So we've got a thing above us right there. Let's pick that up and then we'll check out this spray can that's on the side of this building. You can see on the minimap, okay, we need this sprint here to jump this, I think. So we're going to sprint across. And jump! Glide! Nice! That's how you do it. Yeah! Whew! Alright, so I remember this section. This is where Hey Hyder was. So we can do some graffiti. Neon graffiti. That sounds um, special. Okay, move the controller and hold R2 to shoot neon clouds. Oh god, this is a... Um, this is a wobbly. So I'm guiding this. I'm just filling in all the blanks, right? Oh, little birdies! Oh, okay, are we done? This is not as good as the the Delson one with the spray can. This feels awkward. So we made a bed and a... Oh, look, it's got the mohawk. It's meant to be Brent. That's kind of cool. <laughs> All right, so... I'm probably going to start the next mission now in the next part. So in between that, actually, I'm going to collect a bunch of um, lumen. There was purple glow... Um, red pink glowy things so we'll have quite a few upgrades to use in the next mission all right everyone thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next part bye bye